We had to go all the way 51st. Had to. Leo Jimenez, one of many drivers today, having to turn around as the Salt River flows right over the road. And everyone was late for work. Everyone's calling, frantic, like, what's going on? The Amanda Wynn with c and Trailer Repair <laughs> says they were completely caught off guard by the flooding. Between the flooding and the nearby freeway construction, Amanda says it's difficult to get the semis where they need to go. We have to go down main roads, and the only main roads that are open right now are all cluttered with construction traffic. SRP tells us when it made the decision last week to release the water, it alerted local governments to prepare. Amanda says that message didn't make its way here. There's no information for us. Nobody's come out and talked to us. For now, 51st Avenue is the best way to get into town. This is what it looked like for early rush hour. Good thing Leo's not in a hurry. It's good because another day, woo, I get the troubles. <laughs> Maricopa County Transportation says it alerts people about road closures through social media, emails, and media alerts. It also says there is a study going on right now to considering ways to deal with these Salt River crossings, just like this one here. Live in Levine, Carissa Planout for Arizona's Family.